This is Francis, the great horned owl. This is the one that was caught in the leg hole trap. Let me see if I can get the door locked behind me. I certainly don't want her escaping. Hey there. She hasn't tried to attack me yet, which is nice. I appreciate that. Um, let's see how close I can get. Uh, you can't really see. I don't know if I want to get close enough to try to. Cause I'd, I'd have to lift her feathers up. This is the. Um, this is the bad leg. Let me see what she'll do. It's okay. She can't bite me right now because. Um, well, she could, but it won't hurt. Because uh, she broke the tip of her beak off. Um, trying to extra, uh, extricate herself from the leg hole trap. Here we go. So there's a deep laceration around it. I, I, miraculously did not break the leg. I just can't believe it. Um, and um, the Good Samaritan lives very close to someone who raises fighting cocks. And also got some uh, uh, got got his name in the newspaper for being caught at a uh, cockfighting party or whatever it is they do. But uh, for and for some reason he didn't get in trouble for it. Could be that he's politically connected. And anyway, okay, it's okay. You sure are pretty, Miss Francis. So she'll be with me for a while. Um, the, the beak and the talons are made out of the same stuff our fingernails are made out of. And I don't know if I can get close enough for you to see how her beak is broken off. But, um, she'll be with me for at least a month. See how it's just too blunt? There you go. So she needs that weapon. That's her tearing weapon right there. So it wouldn't do her any good for her to be able to catch a bunny and kill it if she can't tear the food up to eat it. Because uh, they can swallow a third of their body weight whole, but obviously she can't swallow a whole bunny. I mean, she could swallow a big rat hole if she needed to. Um, taxonomically speaking, these guys are right next door to the Caprimulgiforms, which are the... Uh, whippoorwills, um, and, and those guys fly around with their mouths open collecting insects. You, you can kind of see how big her mouth is relative to her head. I mean, her, uh, and she's got a little tongue in there. It's all right, little girl. I won't bother you too much anymore. Okay. Say bye-bye, Francis. Say thank you, Appalachian Animal Hospital, for saving my life. And the Good Samaritan, you know who you are, up in Blue Ridge.